Hey everybody, The Rookie here. Welcome back to episode 5 of my uh, Let's Play Prison Architect. Unpause it and get things rolling again. So we're, we're just going to continue to set up this new, uh, this new wing over here. Last episode we, uh, we got the kitchen and the canteen going and we used the new logistics to set up uh, right there, what kitchen supplies what canteen. So seems to be working because the prisoners only seem to go to this one to eat, so that's good. We'll go in uh, the concrete one. We'll finish off the foundation. Let them finish that off, and then we'll. Once the foundation is done, we'll complete the uh, the common room and the shower, and then the last thing to go in will be all the uh, the cell blocks. more cooks in. Put some more cookers in there too. Yeah, and they'll already be powered. Nice. Check out our programs. Guard taser certification. And some parole hearings. So yeah, everybody's going where they should, that's nice. All the guys who are supposed to be in solitary are in there. Yeah, and he's taking them now for his uh, time in lockdown. We are getting a little low on cash, so I think I'll just let let it run for a little while. Build it up again, and then we'll start to, to upgrade in here. Just to keep my workers busy, I will extend the water over this way. And the power. I finished that uh, the food grant. So programs policies. We can switch it back. We just want medium and medium cut down on the uh, the cost per prisoner each day. The uh, the grant was to serve uh, three high quality, high variety meals three times a day, which was very expensive. So thirty. Um, thirty dollars per day per prisoner. That might even be per meal. So that was lots. So we're going to go to our regime. We're also going to change that. 
they get yard, and we'll also take out the no lunch for them. They eat in the morning and at night, and then it's locked down and yard in the afternoon. Check out the programs again. So he finished the program, but didn't pass it. Go ahead and stop it. Nobody really interested in anything else. Continue laying down the uh, my utilities that I'll need once I start building my cell blocks. I've got the power in here already. Now I'm just running the water down where all my toilets will be set up. Again, just uh, it keeps my workers busy, so they're still doing something. I'm still progressing and moving forward. Here's my prison. Finish off the power down in here. Go ahead and grab some more small pipes and finish off this last section. And that'll be all the utilities for my new cell blocks down. the workers get on that and let them get it done and then we'll start setting up the showers and the common room new power's doing pretty good I think I'll just throw in a few more capacitors just to get on the safe side Is this capacitor doing? That one's doing nice. I shouldn't build, have to build anything else in here, so that should be as high as the power demand gets. So I did build this room a little big. I didn't realize that uh, you couldn't have uh, two generators hooked up to the same uh, to the same system because they just override each other. So it only ever runs on one. Looks like I can set the laundry as well, that's good to know. So I will build a second laundry room in this new cell block then and just have it servicing the new cell block. It's a nice little feature. Yeah, and the guards are grabbing them and taking them where they need to be. Throwing them in lockdown. Workers are still going all out trying to get the uh, the infrastructure or our utilities set in place. Not sure what this room's going to be for. It's just kind of a an expansion area. Just kind of left over from where I put my foundation. Didn't really have plans for it, so you never know, it might come in handy in the future if we need to build a, a specific room or something. Power's in, and water's in.
deploy one guard here. Just so there's always, there's two patrolling, but they're never, are not always close to this door. So we'll throw another one just to generally go around in here, so hopefully increase the speed of guards getting to open this door for my workers. Yeah, there he goes. these ones all the way to the, uh, the main power source. I was wondering why those lights weren't turned on yet. That should do. Pipes are going in. We got a decent amount of cash again. So we'll go ahead and start to set up the shower. Go to planning to do that. So the way I do it, I put shower heads along this wall. Drains down the middle, shower heads along this wall, along here, and that's where I put my next wall. Then we'll go shower head, drain, shower head, wall, shower head, drain, shower head, wall, and do the same thing over here. I might do that the other way. So shower head, drain, shower head, wall. Well, I'll just expand the uh, the common room. I want materials. Demolish this wall. Put another one in there. Get rid of that wall. There. Looks like we had some kind of a fight or a riot over here. Not sure how this is going to work if I designate this as shower. Are these prisoners going to come around and try and use this shower? I'll we'll have to find out, I guess. Good. Nobody in solitary. Workers are almost done in there. We'll check out our programs again. No 
wonder why our taser roller didn't work. Try it one more time. Nobody's interested in kitchen safety and hygiene. We'll just go ahead and stop it. Might as well not waste money on it if nobody's interested. They're slowly getting this done. They had a lot of a lot of pipe to lay down in that new shower. built a, a prayer area yet. That's one of the new features that was added and I haven't actually built that in any prison yet so it'll be interesting to see how that goes. Once I get this new cell block set up I'll probably go ahead and do that just to see how it works. We're going to start behavioral therapy as well. Check on our workers. Looks like they're almost done there so we'll go ahead and use objects. Some shower heads. Place shower heads along all these walls. There we go. So the library, I think, is new as well. Yep. I should try and build that. So that'll be... I can add all those to this area, this extra area I built down here. So that should be okay. Come and grab that guy. Looks like the janitors got into a fight. The prisoners who are working as janitors. Uh, now I can't separate the uh, the cleaning room. That's all right. So now in the common room, we'll just start laying some objects too. Just might as well keep the workers workers busy. those there. We need some, some TVs in here. And some phones. I'm going to see if I can just lock this open for now. Hopefully no prisoners try and run through here. I don't think there's any escape route they can take. It's all sealed off. The only risk would be if they managed to get through these staff doors. But they'd have to get through three of them in order to get out. Or two of them, because that one stuck on a tree, so we'll just have to dismantle that tree. You can see it just keeps opening and closing. It can't actually close properly because that tree's in the way. Get one of my workers out there to dismantle that tree. Looks like the shower's just about done. A few more shower heads to put in.
then they should start moving on to the common room. Yep. TVs are getting put in. Large jail door. That's gonna be what this is for. Put it right there. Kind of be the entrance to my yard for this cell block. this one open. Those are all done, so now we just go to our cloning tool. like it's getting put in properly. Yeah. Nope, it wasn't. I made a mistake there. Uh, we need to go to objects. Get rid of all those. Rooms. Deselect all of these. Go back to cloning tool. That was a little bit off. That's better, now they're lining up. I was one square or one tile off last time, so it was kind of messed everything up. Glad I caught it early enough, though. Good. Just about done here. So we'll go to deployment now as well, and we will put as unlock. Again, just so when these uh, cell blocks start to be completed, the, the cell doors won't close and trap workers in. They'll remain open. a few more prisoners in. Go with 15 again. That's a little too much. We'll go over capacity. We'll just go to 10 for now. That's why that door's open. I was wondering why the staff door was open. I didn't know uh, they were included in the uh, the unlock. Where's my guy patrolling here? Looks like one of my laundry machines was... Yeah, a few of them have been damaged.
Must have been a, a fight or something happened in the laundry room. Get one guard down here just so I can have a look in there. I believe my workers will automatically go and fix it. Oh, that's why I'm in the red for money from uh, putting all the uh, fixtures in my cells, so I have to wait a little bit. It won't take too long. I am making quite a bit of money per week, so... Shouldn't take too long. Check out the original cell block, make sure everything's going good. Everything looks okay. Should run fairly smooth now. Unless like a riot or something drastic happens, but it should be warned about that when it does happen. So everything looks good. Oh, okay. It hasn't bought everything I need yet, so every time I go into positive money, it just buys uh, the next batch of stuff and drops me back down into the red. I was wondering why I lost so much money. Go ahead and stop Taser certification for now. Should be good. Workers are just busy bringing everything in. See, I think this is what will happen. Yeah, as soon as I went into positive, I just bought a whole bunch of other stuff, so I got some lights that time. So I just paid for a reform program, that's fine. Yeah, we'll keep a guard in here at all times. prisoner intake. Turn it down a little bit. Go down to five. We're almost at capacity. Start up parole hearings again. I think that dead body's been there for a while in my morgue. Unless it's a new one. I haven't seen the notification for deaths yet. Or any new ones, so... Probably is still the same guy, just the, uh, the Hearst hasn't showed up yet. 
Yeah, I just bought a bunch of jail doors. Those are really expensive. Holy cow. $15,000 on jail doors. I think what I will go ahead and do... Uh, when it's done, I guess. I will make this... Uh, Maximum security. And that'll be staff only. This will be my maximum security wing. Designated maximum security and have it unlocked at the same time, so I'll just have to unlock it for now. I'll switch it over once the cell block is finished. Yeah, my workers, they're not really doing anything, we're just waiting for some more money now. So I think I'll uh, cut the episode here, and uh, I'll let the game run for a little bit just without recording, and then I'll start the next episode and when I have some money and most of this area is done, just to, to save some time. So thank you everyone for watching, and I hope to see you again in the next episode.